India is located in southern Asia, bordered by the Arabian Sea to the west and the Bay of Bengal to the east. With a population of more than 1.1 billion people, India is the second most populous country in the world. In rural India, mothers and their children often do not receive the medical attention they need for healthy growth and development. Catholic Relief Services trains health workers to promote good nutrition for mothers and newborns, to support routine immunizations, and to help communities and clinics improve their basic health care systems. CRS's health programming in India is focused in the state of Uttar Pradesh, and we work specifically to help the, the government to strengthen its community health workers so they know better how to educate and counsel mothers and children. Um, when, when women become pregnant, no one really quite knows how to take care of them. They don't know that pregnant women really need more food and a good variety of food. Because the families are poor, a lot of times the food might go to the the men who are working in the fields and then come back at night. And the pregnant women um, and the small children are not necessarily getting enough food. Each month, the CRS-trained health workers organize a village health and nutrition day. The workers weigh infants and toddlers, encourage mothers and children to receive vital vaccinations, and distribute nutrient-rich food to families that are suffering from malnutrition. They also educate mothers about the importance of healthy growth and development during the first two years of a child's life. The first 1,000 days of a person's life are the most important days as far as nutrition is concerned, at least as far as the nutrition that will enable someone to, to grow and be as strong and healthy as we want them to be. So what CRS does in training community health workers is helping to give them the knowledge, but also the tools like flip charts or books or sometimes messages even on mobile phones that they can use to communicate to mothers and to grandmothers who are also important caregivers of children as well about what good nutrition is and how they should take care of themselves when they are a pregnant woman so that they are, are getting all of the, the nutrition they need for both themselves and their unborn child. One family I met was uh, headed by a woman named Bitty Devi, a mother of five. When we showed up in the village to see um, her littlest girl, when I first saw the little girl, I thought it was a six-month-old baby. Turned out it was, the, the girl was a year and a half old. Um, she wasn't walking um, because she was so malnourished and so thin. The CRS nutritionist immediately got on the phone to figure out a way we could get this girl into a special nutrition center. And we did fortunately get this uh, little girl in there. So we're very hopeful that she's doing much better. When I was there, what I saw was that children who might have starved to death are doing okay, they're gaining weight. Um, children who were listless, not able to walk, are now able to run around like normal toddlers. So this program is really changing the way the village health workers help mothers and children and saving lives. Through your participation in Operation Rice Bowl, you make it possible for CRS to support mothers and their children through health projects like this one in India. With increased knowledge about good nutrition and better access to quality foods, families in India are able to make sure that their children are growing up healthy and strong. For more information, visit org.crs.org.